Maz, what are your thoughts on tonight's performance? For me, I think disappointed. You know, we wanted to be closer to the top four. We just couldn't get out of second gear and for us it's, it's a disappointing performance and it's something that we need to look at and grow from and hopefully put it right in the semi-final. Is tonight a clear lesson then in the ground that is still to be made up if you're going to close the gap on the top four? Definitely, I think you can't have a bad day. Um, today it was a bad day for us, too many touches, too long on the ball. We just couldn't get, couldn't get it right, especially in that final third. Is there plenty to have been learnt tonight as well then, considering you face the same team in a couple of weeks' time? Yeah, I think that's, that's the beauty of it. You know, we can definitely analyse, go away, do the things that we need to put right and hopefully turn up for the semi-final. Is it also important to look at what has been put right plenty of times already this season and that one game could be seen as a blip moving forward? Yeah, I think, you know, we've done well this season, getting closer to the top four and sometimes we need those games to, to keep us on our toes and it's so disappointing and it, it's, it's hard to, to not come away with three points or a draw and today Chelsea were the better team and they deserved it and hopefully in the semi-final, we, again, we put things right. Is it a tough period for any team to go into an international break with a defeat or is it, is it going to help you that you'll have more time on the pitch to, to prepare and hopefully come out with a better result in a couple of weeks' time? I think ideally, obviously, we'd like to play the following week, but you know we've got some good internationals here that can go away, refresh their minds, come away you know, for a new week and hopefully hit the ground running.